beans. Mm -hmm. That's a good bean pot. Yeah. I know, you don't make beans. I if don't cook. If you did make beans, that would be a nice <laughs> bean pot. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook. I go picking with my boyfriend, sometimes it's my best friend Sue, and sometimes it's my kids. But at the end of the day, it's all about having fun and hopefully just maybe making a profit. All right, action. Yes, we are wet because it's been raining, it's raining. but we're heading into the Goodwill. We did really well at Community A. So well. Uh, so our hope is that the good luck goodwill gods are going to follow us I in. Yeah, just follow us yes, into just the goodwill. Come in with us. And maybe we'll have some good yes. stuff that we can flip for profit, like really good stuff, because the stuff that we found at the community aid is not going anywhere. <laughs> yeah, that's probably going into the hoard. It's probably going to be hoarded. Um, but anyway, we're going to head in here, yes. see what we can find, and we'll catch you in a bit. All right. Wait, wait. Just grab Action. All right, so first we thing we found. This. What is this? This is going home with one of us. This is a lovely vase. Beautiful. My money is on Japanese mariage. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, I can't see a marking, but I would bet. Oh my God, it's money stunning. Is Japanese, and it's in my cart, but it's going home with one of us. We just haven't decided which. I just spotted these, but I picked them up, and I don't like the weight of them, so I'm going to pass on those. That looks like it might be crystal, but it's very heavy and bulky, and I'm not going to go for that one. Uh, we're going to head this way through this little aisle, and we're going to go check out over this way. All right, well, we've got a fairy lamp right here. I'm going to grab it. Fairy lamps have a tendency to do pretty well. At least 20, 20 bucks. Oh, my gosh. All right, um, Longa Burger. Oh, that's kind of cool. What is that? Bunratty Castle. And what is this one? Ladies View, Killarney, Ireland. like Order of the Eastern Star. Fortunately, that stuff doesn't really sell that well. Oh, the will you look at that? The gilding up. What do you think? I think they can't be saved. I think you're right. Uh, a lot of my viewers suggest soaking it in warm water no, and heating it up with a hair dryer, it's but already coming it, off. You really, there's not a whole lot you can do. It's not going to save it. I tried all of these methods, and it doesn't always work. And you don't want to be out that money. So, if the thing is, if it wasn't already coming up, but it's already coming up. So that's a shame. I hate when that happens. I hate when that happens. Yes. It happens all the time. All right, we just did an entire aisle and all we found was a fairy light. We've got to really step it up in this aisle. Really step up our game. We usually find stuff in the brown aisle, so let's see. Okay, well, I have found this pot. And I'm not really sure what the marking on the bottom says. I'm not gonna attempt to show you the marking on the bottom um, <laughs> with one hand, but I do like this pot. I like the design of it, so we're gonna put it in the cart here. I also grabbed these little, I think they're sake cups, possibly. Gosh, I shouldn't do this one-handed. 
I believe these are little sake cups. I'm going to give these to Sue because they match her rose medallion. Pretty. They match your rose medallion, so I grabbed them for you. If you would like them, you don't have to have them. I will not be offended either way. These are Japanese pieces. If I take them, it's probably going to be for resale. Mm -hmm. What I like about them is they're different sizes. No, oh, I didn't even yeah. notice that. Good call. They're, but I like the little flowers because yes, they remind me of your rose medallion. egg cups. Yeah, egg cups. Yes, the Order of the Eastern Star. Yes, those are the girl masons. Mm -hmm. um, my grandmother was in the Order of the Eastern Star. Uh, they tried to stick me in it when I was a kid. <laughs> like, wouldn't you love to become a rainbow girl? Like, please, stop. Oh I'm actually going to take this. Are you? Because yes. I picked that up and I'm like, this isn't worth much. Well, it's not. No. But. But it has sentimental. Though. The fact is, well, and also, that's where my grandmother was. Mm -hmm. But there is going to be somebody whose grandmother was in the Eastern Star who was going to want this. There you go. Also. Ooh, that's actually cute. This. Is, it's like a folk art painting. Yes. Yeah. A little folk I art. I like them iron. better painted than regular. That's like a good door stopper. Uh, yes. Or it could sit on an old stove if someone had an old stove. Um, I spotted this back here. Oh. Denmark. Maybe not. What is that basket down there? Nope, negative. Okay, so I've grabbed this here. And these were actually taped together. <laughs> Clearly, they don't belong together. One is a sugar bowl marked Red Horse Inn. Red Horse Inn. Those kids are up there ringing that bell. Ring my bell. Ring my bell. Um, so one of one is just a little sugar bowl. There's no damage to it. It's marked Red Horse, and I think it has some age to it. The other is just a little um, saucer, and I'm not really interested in the saucer. I just want the sugar bowl, so I'm going to take the sugar bowl, and then I don't know what I'm going to do with the little saucer. But I also noticed these guys, and they're not damaged. A dollar for this guy, and a dollar for this guy. I mean, honestly, I think this one was spray painted. The original color was not black. That was spray painted. I could feel it. But this guy looks like Dumbo. I'm going to take him for a dollar. And I know he's spray painted, but mm, I'll take him too. Because I can't just take one and not his friend. Listen to me, I'm so bad. I'm so sad and so bad. Oh, I know. Little black cat, oh my gosh, look at her. Is she not fun or what? Ceramic, oh my gosh. I mean, it's kind of like one of those Holland Mold things, but you actually put a candle in there and light it up. I think I'm in love with it. <laughs> You know me in Halloween, 1977. There's mushrooms. There is a chip on the back, unfortunately. But, look at her. She's got like a little green wart on her face. I think I'm gonna grab this. I think my life would not be complete without her. She needs a little light, obviously. Oh my God, I almost just broke her. I cannot believe I just did that. Oh my God. You could totally put a tea light in there. You could put a tea light in there. It would be fine. You don't need to stick a little candle light in there, but 
I'm sure this cat was probably her friend for many years. I don't recognize the mark. Probably gonna leave the cat. I know. I'm probably gonna leave the cat. All right, let's see what else we can find. I don't typically do this row, so you never know what kind of treasures you'll find. All right, I think that is everything from this aisle. Give me something good to eat. Or not. We're here to conduct a cart inspection. Well, let's take a look and see what, oh, here. For starters, oh, those beautiful are little cute. crystal um, sterling tops. They're just cute little individual salt and pepper shakers. I like those. However, what was once an individual salt and pepper shaker back in the days when people had dinner for 18 is now a salt and pepper shaker for the ordinary table. <laughs> so, let's pop those in. They're so tiny, I'm afraid they're going to slide through. I just grabbed this. This is a nice little piece and we seem to have all of our little petals intact. I'm very impressed with your um, success rate today with those yes. because normally it's like all of them are pretty sad. Oh wait, is that your phone? Yes. Oh, I'm not used to your new ring ringtone. I'm I. like, wait, is that? Yes, your, wait, wait, you're waiting for Bob O'Reilly. <laughs> all right, that's, yes, that's my alarm. That's right. your alarm that says, all right. ladies, ladies, it's time, it's time now. Um. Here. Remember the Florida plate went up on Etsy? Yes. That was going to be a tidbit Ooh. tray. I have a couple of reticulated Ooh, pieces like that are going to be the start of a new tidbit tray. I like both of those very so, much. Oh yeah. I, I like this nice one piece. most, I think. I do. I I'm like thinking, those colors. I'm not sure, I like the idea of drilling through I know. that piece. But I'm this is what I'm thinking anyway. <laughs> Maybe I won't. Um, you saw that here. This is just a nice sort of atomic design. Mm -hmm. Mid-century round platter. It's really good condition, all things considered. Um, there's some light crazing. Not much. Where are we? Um, stay. Smug, Japanese smug, just pretty. Mm -hmm. um, you know I love mugs. I'm not going to argue with you. This is another piece. Um, this. It has real crazing and faux crazing in yeah, Paris. It definitely. It looks like there's some faux crazing, and then some real crazing because you can see it coming over the edges. Again, just a pretty little piece. I'm fairly certain this is also Japanese, but I have to wait until I pull the little tag off. Um, another Japanese mm, piece. Majolica. Yeah, very nice. And I think that's actually marked Japan, but we'll see. Is this one? Yes, this is marked Japan. It's got all its fingers and toes, <laughs> which is important. A teapot, nice little sort of stoneware piece. Mm -hmm. Just pretty. The bamboo handle as opposed to plastic, which is usually yes. the mark of an older piece, not necessarily better quality. Remember, bamboo was and still is very cheap. <sighs> Mid-century vase. Um, interesting because if you'll note, there's a lot of crazing in this upper portion, the turquoise portion, and none at all in the lower portion where it's a different glaze. So, let's just slide you in there. <laughs> yes, 
And let's see what you Careful, I have those. I saw objects. that. You, uh, the reason it's that is because most... I took it apart. <laughs> Did you? Yes. You were, you were well, responsible. Because I wanted to see what I know, the mark right? Was. Because they're, they're not meant to go together. Chapman. No, they're not. Not at all. If you want the saucer, I only wanted that. I was going to get rid of the saucer. I'll take the saucer. You take this. Okay. Uh, because it was the saucer I was interested in. <laughs> um, but yeah, I took it apart. That's why it's like this. That was me. All I wanted dad. was the sugar bowl. All right. So. Ooh. Looks like a little Dumbo. It is. It's beautiful. Uh, that's a sweet little piece. And no cracks or chips. No. Very impressed. Let's get that little raised. That means something, by the way. I don't know what it is. The little but raised. It means but... something when the little hoops are raised. Hmm. Did you know that with um, like military statues, the position of the horse has meaning? Yes. Like. Um, Two hooves up means death in battle. Yes, I did and, know that. Yeah, yes, this whole um, like iconography thing going. Yes, I know oh, that one has been. It's mommy. Well, it's been spray painted. Can you feel it? Yeah. yeah. So I don't know what it was before, but it's been spray painted. But I couldn't grab one and not grab his friend. You know, it was kind of a pity buy. You know, I would say it's probably worth the time it would take to wipe the spray paint off and see what's underneath. Why not? Nice little project. You know me, I love projects. <laughs> A fairy lamp. That's pretty. It is. I like the coloring. I like it. And, oh, I saw her. I was going to mention her to you. 1977. I almost joinked her head off when I was putting her in the cart. Yeah, that's nice. And then your bean pot. Yes, which I just liked the lines of it. And it's marked on the bottom, but I can't make out the mark. It might say USA. Yeah, it might be. I'm not sure. Um, I like the lines of it, too. It's a nice piece. Mm -hmm. That's a good bean pot. Yeah. I know. You don't make beans. I if don't cook. If you did make beans, that would be a nice <laughs> bean pot. That would be my bean pot if I'm that. Beans. Yeah, well, you know, it's going to be your bean pot even though you don't make beans. That's exactly right until I sell it. Somebody who does make beans. And oh, I think our baby's going to go home with you. I have a feeling. You're not going to have the baby? Well, I think I'm going to hoard it for a yes, while. Yes, I have. I was going to say, I have a feeling I'm going to be able to see that for a while. But that's that's that's, that's on the hoarder list. Yes, I'm, I'm hoarding is. a lot from today, I will be honest. I mean, I've got a schoolhouse full of shades if you're looking for something <laughs> for that. That's a stunning lamp. It really is. So, yeah, like I say, I think I'm going to be seeing this for a while. <laughs> your house. And then when we're ready to sell it, then you can have the exactly. sale. <laughs> All right, let's grab our thumbnail. Oh. Go. All right. Well, I think we did okay. I think that lamp was just... Really beautiful. The lamp um, really... was a win. The lamp was the carryover goodness from the community. Aid. Well, I actually got a lot of stuff in there. You Little killed things. it. And I'm like, oh, I can't find anything. And I look in your cart and I'm like, oh, man. Yeah, because I took all the good stuff. <laughs> but I really like that Halloween witch. And Halloween too. things do really well for you. Yeah, That's sort of your vintage. holiday. 77 is vintage. Yes, it is. So Sorry to nice say piece. it. <laughs> and the bean pot, and who knows? The bean pot. We might even get Jocelyn to cook. Well, we can always dream, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so make sure you stay tuned tomorrow for the haul video where we talk about how much we paid for stuff and how much I think I can get for it, either on Etsy or eBay. Um, and that includes today's video and yesterday's video. So. Right. And so. don't forget to go over and check out Sue's channel. There's a link to it. Sue me. Down in the description. So go check that out. All right. And, uh, fabulous. Let's we'll catch you guys later. We will see you guys. Bye. Have a great week. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you've spotted something that you just can't live without, don't worry. I've put a link to our Etsy store down in the description.